I would be driving this. A Jake's Fabworks JF5U. James would be driving this. And a Lumi Craft Class 10. And Hammond would have this. A plastic green pickup truck. Okay, now this is supposed to be oh, Volkswagen Beetle. Because that is where this sport began, people racing bugs around the desert. But it's got a 2.4 litre Chevrolet engine and a sequential gearbox. The only thing it really has in common with the Beetle is nothing. Jumping. <laughs> oh, we go. 16 inches of suspension travel at the front. at the back means landing is really very comfortable. Oh, yes! My 2013 Curry underneath this plastic pickup body has the same tubular space frame chassis as the other two, but I've only got a two-litre engine. However, it's a Ford EcoBoost, so it's turbocharged. And they've tuned it, so it's putting out, just shy, landing, 300 brake horsepower. <laughs> and now I'm going to fly again. Ah! <laughs> this is bliss. Meanwhile, in the Illumi Craft Class 10... <coughs> We've got dust in my face. It doesn't have a windscreen. I don't like cars with no windscreen. <coughs> Why do I let the others talk me into this? Why don't I just tell them to bugger off? <laughs> Last time I did that, it ended very badly. The races they do in these things are enormous. Hundreds, sometimes a thousand miles or more. Sometimes they'll spend nine hours a day in the driving seat. Oh, I so want one of these. Come on, let's have some air here. Yeah. <laughs> what a riot! How can James May not enjoy this? As it happened, he was starting to enjoy it. And we! <laughs> Get it sideways a bit. Watch me fly! Here I go! <laughs> I'm gonna do one more. After Billy Bob May had had his fun... Whee! We all stopped for a breather. Yes. I don't like admitting you're right, but I can be magnanimous. It's brilliant. Right? You've wasted your life with Chopin and plywood. You're a dune racer. You've always been a dune racer, you just didn't know you were. It was just fantastic, and it's comfortable. That's the thing. It's comfortable motorsport because of the suspension. It's just, it's brilliant. It's cheapskate motorsport. Is it? Yes, it's cheapskate motorsport for people with dicky backs. That's what it is. Because landing is so oh, soft. Sometimes I'm thinking, have I landed? Yes. Really anyway, I've got a brilliant idea. What? Time trial, flying lap, one at a time against the clock. I'll go first. You really? <laughs> you must have put that right. <laughs> Where's my car? He has taken to it, hasn't he? He really has. Having jumped back in, Billy Bob embarked on his flying lap. Here he comes. Go. Here we go. Hey. That's James May. That's <laughs> just not right, is it? What's next? He's going to take up cage fighting. <laughs> Oh, my God! <laughs> Look at those cats, you kick the arse out. Well, we don't know whether that's fast or not, but it is less than a minute. 
Is yeah. that the first time he's done anything in less than a minute? He can't open a car door in less than a minute. No, he can't. Or sign his name. No, that's two minutes. Definitely. Biggles is back. I can do a slightly better one than that. Can I have oh, another God's go? Sake. Next, it was my turn. I just want to say, Hammond. What? You have twice as much horsepower as me, and May, you have 50 horsepower more than I've got. So it's only my men's skill that's going to put me in contention here. Is it? Now, well, what else is there? This sounds like you any excuses ready for the end of this, right? Really. Yours weighs less. It's 200 kilograms lighter than this. Mm. I'm just saying, in case I'm not as quick. Eventually, Mr. Racing Excuses was underway. Here he comes into his flying lap. <laughs> There are few things in life I enjoy more than delivering bad news to Jeremy Clarkson. It's possibly my favourite thing. Forcing myself not to do a little dance. How much faster was I? Well, unless your seconds were smaller, you were slower, because you were 58.5. What was he? 57.81. What that means is, he beat you. I cannot believe that. Has anybody got a gun? Finally, it was the turn of Ricky Redneck. Right, ready with the stopwatch. This is how you do this. Oh, yeah. He's in a pickup truck. On a loose surface. Yeah, he's at home. You know, at the moment, you're winning. Yeah. In a minute, you won't be. What are you looking at? A glint. You see it? No. <laughs> Into the left hander. Keep it tight. Oh, what was that? What the hell was that? That was... What's the matter with him? Has he bust the gearbox? What? Well, not very quick. What was the matter? That was the weirdest thing. What? It's like a ricochet. <laughs> 